Hi, Janet here. I was talking to one of my team the other day who was feeling completely overwhelmed about the amount of information that she was trying to absorb. This of course is known as information overload and we've all suffered from it at one time or another, especially when we're starting out in a new internet business. Now while it won't go away altogether, it can be managed and it also is completely normal so don't worry about it. So I thought I'd do a quick video um, on some simple ways to help cope, cope with this. I'll assume that you are with an internet business um, that has a good training program. However, even if they lead you step by step through the various marketing strategies that are available, it's extremely easy to get sidetracked. Um, since you start putting out your contact details, of course you're going to be bombarded by email from other people all wanting to tell you something. Don't be put off by this though, because there's some very good free and low cost information which you can actually find this way. But you do need to learn to sift through your emails quickly, save the ones that you think might be of interest and delete everything else. I only check my emails twice a day, um, first thing in the morning and last thing at well, last thing in the afternoon that gives me time to sort of get back to anybody that I need to get back to. Now you'll also find that social networking can take up an awful lot of time. Um, so if necessary, set a timer. Um, don't spend any more than one hour on Twitter and, and Facebook. So what are some other ways that you can actually manage information overload? My number one method is by having a daily method of operation. Now I actually have this on a spreadsheet. You just have a column, seven columns for each day of the week of course, and then I divide it into hourly intervals. Um, I then cross through the hours that I actually don't want to work. I might want to, I might be going out with family or I've got appointments, that sort of thing. Um, and then I can go from there. Um, my personal death, daily method of operation is learning of some sort in the morning either listening to webinars, watching, reading, um, all that sort of stuff. And then in the afternoon, I do all my doing. So I'm, I'm placing ads, I'm writing um, articles, making videos. Um, my social media I do in the evening before I go to bed. Okay, the second thing you can do is make daily and weekly goals. This gives you something to work towards. Write them at the top of your DMO sheet and tick them off each day when you've completed them. And it does give a really good feeling of satisfaction once you've, you can see what you've accomplished. Now when you first start your new internet business, certainly spend a few days reading through everything that you're going to be learning. But then choose just one thing at a time to thoroughly learn and absorb. Don't try and learn half a dozen things in the first week. Um, it really is the way to complete overwhelm. You'll end up doing your heading completely and you'll be leaving the business in a very short time. But if you do things, find that things are getting on top of you, have a couple of days off. Go visit a friend, go to the movies, just get away from the study and you'll find that you'll go back completely refreshed. So I hope these ideas um, will help you with your information overload. Um, I have written more in depth on, about this on my website, which is www.janethowton.com and you'll other, also find some other helpful articles which will help you in your internet marketing, as well as a link to Carbon Copy Pro, which is my chosen marketing platform. So enjoy your business guys, have a great day and I'll see you next time.